All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chupacabra Tutorials channel. I'm your host, Larry. Today, I'm going to show you how to create a Steam account so that you can start buying and playing games on Steam. The first thing you need to do is head on over to steampowered.com, or you can just Google Steam, and it should pop up. And then you want to go to the login button in the upper right-hand corner of the screen. From here, it'll just take you to the login page, and that's not really that helpful, I'm sure you're thinking because you don't have an account yet, but if you scroll down, it gives you the option down here and it says new to Steam, go ahead and create an account. So go ahead and click on that lovely blue button. And then from here, you can input whatever email you address you want to associate with this account. Do note that you'll be spending money on this account, so it's probably a good idea to use a secure email so that nobody gets into it and tries to steal any of your credit card information or other payment details. In this case, I will just use my Chupacabra email. And then I will also need to confirm my email, so I'll have to input this twice. And then I am from the United States. I am confirmably not a robot from Mars. I am 13 years of age or older, and I will click continue. From here, it'll think for a moment, and it'll probably want me to go to my email and verify my email address to continue. So here is my email, it just says, hey, you wanna verify that you're people? And I'll be like, yes, I am 110%, a whole people. Once this verification email is done, we can go back to this account page, and then it'll ask me what kind of name I want to use, so I'll go ahead and fill that out. So I have chosen to go with Chupacabra Tutorials because I already have an actual like Steam account with my personal email, so I don't wanna use that twice and then I will click on done. So from here, you're gonna wanna go ahead and install Steam if you haven't already, and it'll ask you to log in again. That is the main Steam client where you will buy games and then you will also download them and play them. Most of the heavy lifting for Steam does not happen through the web browser, although you can purchase games through the web browser and then they will automatically sync with your account so that you can grab them on your desktop using the Steam Launcher itself to then go around and play games and buy them and all that good stuff. But this is just a guide on how to get your account together and logged in and all that good stuff. And then you're gonna have to jump in and check out what kind of games you want to play. And then once you find one that you're interested in, you can go ahead and click it. You can then add it to your cart. And then you can go in here and you can buy it for yourself by going through the checkout process. Then it will be sent to your launcher, the Steam, you know, software, which you can click on at the top here to install Steam. It'll just tell you where do you want to download it to. And then once you install and log in with the same information you just put into Steam, you can then download the game and start playing it with all your friends. If you don't have friends, you can start finding friends and making new connections with people and playing awesome games together. So I hope you found that helpful. I've been your host, Larry. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will catch you next time. Bye, everybody, and have a good one.